Okay, another little quick video on the dimensions of these action camera cases. Uh, just did a video on the dimensions of the front bezel. But I figured some other people probably want to know maybe the overall dimensions on the outside. I think that's out there, but I'm going to do a little more broad look at it, you know, because sometimes they talk about the dimensions of the camera itself and not the dimensions of this whole apparatus. And when you're trying to rig up something, you need to know how big this is and not necessarily how big the camera is. So, here we go. Draw out my thing. And I'm going to be liberal with the dimensions because I want to be it have to be a little bit on the big side just to Leave some room for error. All right, so this is looking like 76.6 .6 millimeters wide. Now, if you include the screw here, you're going to need to be more like 84, 84 and a half. It's hard to get that number because I don't have anything on here, but um, so those are your two dimensions width wise. Now the camera and I'm going to include a little bit of the base because it's not like you can have a GoPro without some kind of connecting point. So that is 82 and a half millimeters. Yeah, of course, I forgot to give you inches on the other ones, but you can convert it just to make this video quicker. I'm just going to list the millimeter. You can go on Google and convert those on your own. Okay, so this is a Hero 4 case, a smaller case. And it's going to be right around 70 millimeters if you include the screw it'll be more like 75 75 yeah be safe with 74 millimeters all right and height wise you just stay outside probably about the same that's interesting about 74 by 74 millimeters square is what the space of the exterior of this is going to take up at minimum now it'll squeeze right in there if you use those dimensions <clears throat> but obviously you're going to need to get you may need to get to the button so you're gonna have to keep that in mind all right you're under the old hero 3 dive housing case now including this button it's going to be about 79 and a half millimeters and height wise probably around about the same so these two that's pretty cool so the two gopros the, their footprint they take up is actually square which is interesting and uh, this one's obviously a little bit smaller footprint but if you wanted something that could fit both of your gopros um and probably your your china pros too if you were to make an 80 millimeter square hole or space, it would probably be, you'd probably be able to get all of these different action cameras into that hole. So, for those of you out there that are you know like to tinker and make things for these action cameras, rigs, and things, that this info might be useful to you. So, take it easy.